look, if you're taking my Geography 4010, 3435, 2020, or my Geostatistics class, you've been given access to ArcGIS.com. This gives you the ability to log into ArcGIS Pro if you have it installed on that particular computer or within the lab. If you look at ArcGIS Pro, you can see what it looks like here in the upper right. It says sign in. Also for ArcGIS.com, we see sign in. There's two different ways to sign in. So we can click on sign in and we'll look at this one way here. So I can click on my organization's URL click on DEGS NCCU and click on North Carolina Central University. So we type in DEEGS NCCU and then go to North Carolina Central University. You can click on this button and then use your NCCU username and password. Now there's another way we can do this using a username and password from ArcGIS Online and I've provided a default for every single student here in case this NCCU login doesn't work. So I can type in GIS student underscore DEGS NCCU and then the password is spring 2020 exclamation point with a capital S. So spring 2020 with an exclamation point and a capital S. And then I can click sign in and you can see I'm signed in as GIS and allow me to make maps and whatnot. I can do the same exact thing here for ArcGIS.com. Okay, so that this login is also going to work for ArcGIS.com. Here, I'll log in using my organization's URL. So I'll type in DEGS NCCU. And you can see North Carolina Central University. And now it's asking me to log in using my AD credentials from NCCU. And so these are the, my AD credentials. Now I'm logged in, and then you can see I'm logged in as tmulroon at ad.nccu.edu. So these are a couple different ways to log into either ArcGIS Pro or ArcGIS.com using your NCCU credentials or the default username and password that I've created for all of my students in case those don't work.